everyone, I'm Timoteo. And I'm George. And we, we are Vintage Doll Hunters. On this channel, we will be discussing and reviewing what we found on our latest Vintage Doll Hunt, sharing with you our opinions and our knowledge. We provide you, the audience, quality information based on our eight years of collecting experience, either from the homes of others or from our own collection. So join us as we reveal what we found today. Let's get started. Hi guys, welcome back to our channel. We're very excited today to bring to you another episode and another fun find to share with you all. This is gonna be an awesome find. Uh, we These are kind of uh, bigger pieces and they're gonna be really fun to lay out and show you guys. Mm -hmm. They are from the year 1961 and 1963. Yes, yes sir. very fun. And they're, uh, like I said, three, two, one. Barbie structure! Yes, Barbie structure! Yes, and we'll start with the original one that came out in 1961. Yes, 1961, made of what was it called? Lithogram, chipboard? lithogram chipboard. Yes, lithogram the harder chipboard. textured material for its encasing and the materials inside. And this one right here was a fun find. It's, it's been in the collection for a while, a few yes. years now. But this is it, this is the casing outside. It has a fun little handle. Um, basically, this was intended to fold out, which we'll demonstrate in a little bit, yes. but you can carry it around. Yeah, and it was, it, it, it was supposed to be light, but it's kind of heavy. It so really is. For a child? Wrong little girl to carry this big old thing around, yes. especially if you have to put more stuff <laughs> inside of it. It's true, I just thought about that. That is heavy. Oh, but that is really heavy for a, a, a little child. <laughs> but it, at one time came with this huge wrap around it, which had a picture of what to do, you know, what it looked like. And um, those are really kind of hard to find these days because you know those little papers, people just rip off and throw away. But let's show you how that yeah, this enclosed first had these little uh, latches yeah. that could lock it, open it. But so we're gonna open it up for you to come out. Yeah. Oh, here, let's turn it around this way. Actually, it has to go this way, but it has like a little imaginary. But door. that's the front. So we're showing you unlatching it. Scenery and then, and then bam. Bam, it falls down. So it came. Um, Unassembled with the parts inside the walls open up. Here we go. Yeah, be careful because all this fun stuff is in here. I'll wait, but, for, I'll wait for you. Well, go ahead. And then they have a watch out with the little furniture that's going to just pop but off. This is all lithogram cardboard, which is why it's like really sturdy. Why a lot of it's lasted the whole time is because it's a really sturdy material. Um, and it's really fun uh, because, as you can see, okay. we got, oh, well, let's right, start. Right. I'll pull this one out. So these are little uh, furniture pieces you can see that you put around. Yeah, and they were actually the all um, flattened. Um, so you had to pop them out and little assemble them yourself. That was yeah. a little fun little crappy thing they, for even, you as a kid. On this one, you could see the numbers like yes. kind, of, kind of similar. I guess I want to I want to relate it to like IKEA furniture. They number and letter everything. Teach kind of easy step by step <laughs> of how to <laughs> assemble these little cardboard pieces of furniture. Very sturdy though. Like you're really holding your hand. I'm like this is not delicate little piece of like it's not cheap. It's very yeah, high a, quality. I, I believe there's also like a little video of the of uh, the commercial and the little girl shows you how you snap it all together and put oh, your something fell out. It oh, is. the hangers fell out. Oh, there's little hangers, how fun. It's really fun right here. You got the TV set or radio with hi-fi. Yeah, it looks like a radio and hi-fi they called it back in those days. And you're able to rearrange the furniture. This was a little drop. I believe it was uh, like in behind to add to the little stuff. Ah! Barbie's bed. And of course, this, this is Barbie's dream house. This is her studio, they reference uh, and they reference it as is her studio. So she got her studio couch. She has her bed right here, mm -hmm. which a lot of time is put right here in the in the scheme of, of arranging the furniture and whatnot. But it's really cute, really super sturdy. Um, a little lamp furniture. that you uh -huh. can put somewhere really nice to light up the room. A row of books, I guess. Sparky. Oh wow! Nice to read. And uh, don't forget a picture of Ken at night, making sure that she has someone to kiss before bed. How pretty is that? Keep it very pretty. Uh, and then what are these? Uh, books that you're able to arrange yeah, right here, on your little right shelf. There you go. Oh, there's I'll another set. Right here. Oh, and these are really, really hard pieces to come by. Um, but for sure, you know, these are uh, really cool to have uh, if you have them. And look, George, just to let you know real quick, let's go ahead and put those on that side. So what these little uh, things do are these are little clips that you're supposed to clip on both sides so it holds it together. Uh, We're trying to be careful. We don't want to fray the cardboard. So there you go. It, so it makes it more of a, a sturdier wall. Yeah. Um, so that that's kind of Keep the job. Separating, Correct. Yeah. That's the job of those little things. And you know, those 
usually get lost quite a bit. So that was a really neat find. And we got oh, the mirror. This mirror is a little vanity mirror. It goes inside. It's an insert um, right here. Yeah. yeah, a little insert like George said. You know, push them in. Vanity mirror and a vanity stool. A little vanity stool. You enjoy that, huh? Your own mm -hmm. little vanity stool. Mm -hmm. That'd be neat. And in this one, I guess we have tons of hangers. Uh, but usually, Jesus. I believe this comes with what? Well, pink. Eight, pink? Eight pink hangers, yeah. Eight pink hangers. Um, but what you're able to do is put your little clothes here for Barbie and stick her uh, hangers up here because a little yeah you can rod. like they, they intended for this so you can be able to play of course a child can play open it up and do her do their thing and arrange the furniture and live their dream Barbie fantasy life but then also they can store their clothes on these little hangers the costumes that they purchased for Barbie. And then when they're all done, they can kind of just put it all back and then store it into the closet. As they like to say, um, very uh, convenient for mother. Yes. She would appreciate that because, you know, mother didn't want to be stepping all over the toys once uh, they were done playing with the dream house. But it's wonderful. And my favorite thing about this type of structure is the this lithogram cardboard chipboard that they use. It's just so sturdy and it's so strong. And it's obviously withstood the, the, the test of time, like, for sure. This is, this is an amazing. I love how it's all geometrical because it has to be, it's cardboard. It kind of gives it like this cartoony sort of feel to it. Yeah, I like all the prints. Yeah, very, very and nice. It, it gives you the sense also that she's, you know, of course, going to college. You got her state little flags there. Mm -hmm. I love the little, little extras they add in. They put a little yellow carpet on the bottom just to give you a look that, hey, there's a little carpet here. And then this is what I found. And these, like, you get lost, you lose these little things. This is a little cardboard pillow, little accent pillow that you kind of just <laughs> it's add. True. You know, not too comfy, but you know, it's nice to have the little accent things. And I believe this here, if you look inside, yes, there's oh. little records for the hi fi, and they come with all these Nat King Cole and Vince Cyan, uh, Sinatra. I mean, Barbie is listening to the best. She's cultured. And she's very cultured, and that's a cool little, uh, uh, little high five for her to have and it's kind of neat that she even has a picture of herself <laughs> on the TV that's kind of neat oh yeah so let's 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 he was putting dolls in here to try to demonstrate uh, well I believe I have the date doll that where I she have. at here she is so this would most likely be kind of the time where the time party would be See, out just her size ready, so perfect getting stuff ready maybe having a little date with Ken getting ready you know listening at the vanity mirror sampling her pillow mm -hmm. <laughs> But yeah, she usually has fun just going up and down, playing around. That's always nice. Uh, Barbie hanging up her clothes. Yeah, right? this, this one though, I will say this dream house right here, it's, it's really nice. Um, the Mattel did, did make a reproduction of this dream house. So you will yeah. see those mm -hmm. out there. But the originals, of course, you can always check the date. And there always seem to be a little more weathered, of course. And yeah. you can always tell which ones are the originals. But always a date, you guys. Always, always a bit of date. And that stuff is, oh, it's on the bottom. We can't show you yeah. right now. Yeah, but some, of these, some of these just did not but make I'll it. Insert here. <laughs> did not make it. Yeah, but this is amazing. And we're going to keep taking care of this. It, I love it so the much. The color, too. The color that it stood. But let's go ahead and try the opportunity of trying to put this all back yes. in it's here. A, it's, it's very much a game of Tetris. It's just like... It's just like, put it together, Talented. put it back, to, ooh, put it back, ooh, no, no, not like that, George, okay. Exactly. Just dropped all Barbie's records, oh, there goes all his records, I'll do this. I think. Oh, wow, there you go, there you go, you got it, you got it. I'll do this right here. So we'll put the couch, here we go. Oh, the pillow. Another one, another one. Yeah, but there, I think there's, a, there's more pillow pieces. pieces. There's more pillow pieces that that, that that do come along with this. Those are the other plastic pieces. Oh no, almost ready that one. So we're gonna close it up. Oh, fold that. I don't want to just drop that in there. Be careful. There we go. There we go. Then we'll pick that side out. It folds right Push back it up. In. It's so Open. simple. Anyone can do it. Oh, there you go. A latch. Oh. It's so simple, anyone can do it. <laughs> and ta -da! ta da! There we go. And here goes her Stay dream house. This is the first go, dream go, house. Let's go. Yeah, and so, uh, so, so, so you saw the writing on here. And 61, teenage fashion model. I don't know if the overcall stuff is in there, but we'll, no, what, what dream house. Like, here's kind of the gist of how big it is. Yes. Yeah. Huge. Very huge. Can't really strong it. little girl, and she has a you know really like, I, I, strong I, I, one arm. I still get worried though. Like I wouldn't try to pick it up yes. from here because there's a good Don't chance that it might just break. Pick it up from the side. 
Right, yeah. Hands are oh yeah, it's cardboard. It'll exactly. absorb grease. It'll absorb, you know, it's cardboard at the yeah. end of the day. Even though it's lithograph cardboard, it's still cardboard. Yeah. And want to go now to the next uh, structure that uh, we found. It's yes. Kind of, uh, this one was very recent. Like I said, this one that we just did uh, has been in our collection for a uh, good couple. Yeah, the a majority. couple of years. I mean, mean, like this was one of our first finds, though, right? Because we were hunting. We we started at the bottom, so we were trying to collect all the first series of what was out there. But this recent find, once again, I took a day off of work just to be there at what was it, eight a.m. and stood first in line. Where? Open, open. It was a it was a thrift. It was a thrift store yeah. that was a little past Scottsdale, I believe. Never really been that part of. Uh, Phoenix, I don't know what part it would be, but I thought it was more of a Scottsdale-y kind of out there and really nice part. So anyways, uh, they had- I know, let's get to the <laughs> good part. So once they let me in, I you know already was looking through the windows where they were at, trying to figure out how I was gonna be the first in line and push my way through. But as soon as I got there, I claimed them, put them on the uh, counter and walked out. Uh, no, no second thoughts. And and here is the first one. Yeah, which one you want to show? The uh, 1963, I believe we said right. And this it is, is a 63. The new, there's we're, yeah, it's both the same year, both the same. Yeah, year. it's both, both the same, same year. year. Uh, but it was the change of the structure of what you just saw. Uh, they added more of a uh, little more detail. We'll get into that right now. So let's pull that this one out. Uh, and this one. Here we go. This is the new dream house. The new dream house. It looks really used. <laughs> so that's okay. It's the new, but same thing. Here's the one side with the with the with the name, of course, and this is the side with the latches. But this one, the latches are broken. Yeah, but this one actually has a twist. They're a little twist plastic. If if you, uh, I can probably zoom in and give you some of that. But they're real fragile. We didn't look like they were in the last. We're so lucky that they lasted this long. But what the concept is, do they lock in place? And then you're able to open this up, which basically, yeah, sure, uh, turns into the whole flooring of the house. There we go. And this one, the reason why uh, it's new and like improved, as they say, Mattel, uh, you know, kind of up to, is you're able now to rearrange pieces. So these pieces are kind of free ah! now to move around and about throughout, uh, but quite a bit of a pieces to take care of. <laughs> wow, yeah. So on this one, uh, let's go ahead and uh, see if we can get this open there. Let's try to do the first section of the house. Uh, is the bedroom. And the bedroom came with tons of little pieces that... And a sliding door. Uh, sliding door. Let's, let's try to first take them all out. Oh my goodness, there's so much. Oh. And you know, a lot of these things you had to put together yourself. You know, that was a part of the work. For oh really no, some of these in here um, need more than just to put together. Yeah, and that's and that's kind of the problem with the older structures with the cardboard. You know, they come loose, or you know, just kind of some people just in and out it and just frays it up. Whatever. I just it, it, you know the problem with I think probably this one has so many pieces. It's hard to store everything inside of here because even being in there. See, like this one probably was this little couch. Oh, this poor little couch. Yeah, that's like I go back together. We'll but same thing, they're assembled in pieces, but all the chairs are still pretty good right here. We got um, chairs with it, like a uh, little table. Oh, here's the sliding door you were talking about right here. Like, yeah, that's what I said. Two, yeah. Oh, did you? Yeah. <laughs> Well, shut that door. What but, about these pieces? Are you going to show these? Okay, first? so so I, well, it's so much. I mean, let's start. Let's start. This, this one is, is in the back, so we're going to put these in the back. So uh, this is the outside patio. Where's the bed? I do not see a bed. Ah, there's no bed. Yeah, yeah she's right here. Oh, it's still oh, still inside the the other part. This is a really big structure. This had uh, uh, as they um, announced it as it was basically. Uh, Barbie's new dream house, but it's a lot bigger. It's like she there's multiple rooms, so that's why we have so many Some things. Stuff on that side right there. All right, I'll move pull it out. We don't need it right now. Little thicker thing. Okay, so what are you gonna show first? So we're gonna show the bedroom. This is the inside of the bedroom. A sliding door to go out to the patio. We'll show you that when we flip that around. Here's uh, Barbie's uh, bed. Uh, oh, kind of oh, put that very down pink. here. Everything's usually pink. Same thing with her. Little uh, lamp, and this is her little side dresser table, and then oh, and then in here is 
I believe a um, stub, they're going to be put shelving in here. There's usually a, oh, let's move that around over there. And so we have Barbie's little lamp against her bed there. This is actually part of the fireplace and milk. Milk carton, I guess it goes in the kitchen. <laughs> Don't want to spill the milk. It's a lot of stuff. But came with uh, this little fun stuff. Um, there was a little couch. I can't find a little pink couch. Uh, where I have it? a pink chair. So I probably yep, there it goes. There's the, how it matches. There's nothing else pink over here. So this would be more of her little bedroom structure you'd get. And, and you'd play with Barbie over here. I don't have a Barbie um, playful to play around in. Do you have a playful Barbie over there? One in the swing dress? This one? Yeah, that would be a nice little Barbie to bring in here. So uh, most likely, like I said, she's just kind of uh, walking around her bedroom, getting ready. And, Good structure for her, her size. She can walk in and out of the back of this little sliding door. And then after we uh, pull you out of that sliding door, who knows, we'll take you into another venture into another room. <laughs> so let's go ahead and uh, disassemble this and we'll see what the next little thing you can do with this little Barbie structure. Well, this is not just with this structure, this is just this room. Hello, Laura. Correct. So we flip it. I'm not sure how this holds. Oh, it's a side. Okay. Well, well, we'll bring this out in a second because then we're going to go ahead and show uh, kind of the outside of this structure. The tissue box fell out. I don't know what that is. So now this is the inside of her living room slash kitchen uh, Barbie. Uh -huh. So this is the newest. She actually goes outside to make her little thing. So what we'll do here is we kind of bring it out real quick. And then it opens up. Go ahead and bring it over here. And so this is tied for this little uh, this little table is actually the thing, piece that actually separates the two things. Um, so you have your living room area over here, your little kitchen dinette here on this side. Two little chairs to kind of complete the kitchen. So there's basically furniture for each part of the house. Yes. And that's what makes it really neat. I mean, they give, they give you a lot of space, but they give you a lot more to play with just so you weren't left, I guess, empty. Empty. Yeah, true. yeah so you weren't left empty. Oh, I, yeah, I guess. I, I, I understand that. But I guess. Little lamp. I'm unfortunately missing the little piece of the blue lamp. Sometimes, you know, these things get lost along the way. And um, that's kind of, you know, unfortunately what happens. And here's a little fireplace. It has a little piece of cardboard. You can check out the wood. It's also a cover for it. No sliding door in this you one. Know, <laughs> I usually want to put that on there. But this is the living room slash kitchen area uh, for Barbie's little dream house. Um, and that's uh, one. The new dream house. The new dream house. That's its official name. <laughs> so this is a scary structure. Yeah, it, but what's <laughs> cool about it is it opens up. See how it goes right oh here? Oh my god, look at that. Then there's more. There's the living room to this whole huge living room set. Look at that. Here's the sofa. I know this probably goes in here, but the sofa is RIP right now. You can then move that table, and now you're on the other side there we go. of the kitchen. And George, unfortunately, the couch that you know he was playing with is just all disassembled because it wasn't my fault. Yeah, it's like, no, <laughs> it's just kind of the way it goes. But it's this is nice. Still, this little table page. right here is nice. It's still sturdy. And this one now, we need, we need to do some surgery, reconstruction surgery in some of these pieces, hopefully to help it out. But you got a little side table. A little couch, mm -hmm. you can sit in the front. You know, oh, well, that was oh, wow. kind of say, I kind of wanted, yeah. <laughs> I, like, I, like, I like the different rooms, and that's cool. Like, if you watch the commercial, too, they'll show you how um, they kind of involve, like, Ken, you know. It's big enough to include more of the characters in it, not just, like, a solo studio apartment, like the original Dream House, where Barbie was just roaming about it by herself. This has room for Ken, for Alan, and even for Mitch. Don't forget Barbie. Yeah, Barbie. She is. Ooh, hey. Yeah, she has a good time going around. It's a fun little time yes. for Barbie. And what's neat about, what's neato about this is I like this uh, little TV because what it has is these little sleeves that you're able to take out and kind of change around. So it looks like they have different things on TV to watch. <laughs> There's about, I think, three, I believe, cars in here that kind of go flip back and forth. That's really cool. And, you know, that was the coolest thing back in the day, have a TV. Wow, heck yeah, that was that was awesome. Yeah. Like I said, this also has the opening of George on the other side of the kitchen. Ah. So you can remove the, the, the uh, little 
long table, table and pull it up to the other side uh-huh. and still kind of utilize that and you know sit back there and have Inter- a little interchangeable pop pieces. Pop out and say, hey, what's that? This one's a lot. <laughs> this one's this a little bit longer to set up because there's a lot of awesome oh. more pieces to to put so up. much to put it together. Uh, and just try to keep uh, back assembled because unfortunately some of these you know just kind of loosen up and it's hard to go back. But you don't want to force too much of that stuff back. And I've seen a lot of uh, this. Um, it looks like they actually added even tape. I'm not sure if it came with maybe a little sleeve of, of, yeah, of no, tape. I can see some tape on this one. So it's that like they just kind of added, but a lot of the pieces already had like dried up and fallen mm-hmm. out. But I did save them too. I don't know. I just kind of collect that stuff as well. It's like someone taped it a little bit, a little bit. But it needed it because I get how complicated is it. But I'm sure, I'm sure the girl girls have fun with it, yeah. or not even whatever little kids play with it. Sorry, it's not just for little girls. It's for little everybody. Yeah, I like to. It's fun. So if you want to um, look at this print. Yeah, I see. Like, I see the, uh, okay, yeah, that's cool. I like it. It's really nice over here. But yeah, see, there's a tape everywhere. Poor little things. Like I said, some of this doesn't even get to go back together. So it's one quick thing when you, you can even like, maybe put that down. I wanted to show the sliding door once again because um, on the other side of that sliding door was an actual grill. So you could... Uh, and the sliding door and Barbie comes out and then there's a little grill back here and you can do this outside little thing and then oh, that's what this yep. is for to make like a little separation maybe a little wall Ooh, here it is right here somewhere oh. yeah it's right here something going on there but yeah you know you put that in a little backyard setting play out here barbecue with her barbecue well, probably for the tabletop right there that's oh yeah that that's is. probably the, the, once again Look at that. Yeah, the, the main star. Bowl. The main star. Oh, of, here it is on the side. The Lord. main star of the backyard and the whole house apparently is this tabletop. Yeah, okay. <laughs> it's nice though. It's a little interchangeable. It's I'm nice. nice. Yeah, it's true. You can have a, you have a cookout right there. The brick. Cardboard, how fun. Yeah. brick. Everything looks really nice. My dad would love that. It's construction, so yeah, I'm sure he'd love that. Be appreciative on that one. So let's. Try for everything back. Oh, well, I don't think we should try for everything back. Maybe we should just try to get some of it off. Because like I said, this is very delicate. Um, thank goodness a lot of the pieces uh, stood together and were able to last throughout the years. But it is a very delicate set. But uh, fortunately, there's a lot of pieces that uh, continued on with the set. Oh, my God. Became a whole uh, uh, collection together. Well, that was busy. Well, let's move on to the next well, one. Well, you know, it's, more it's, it's a lot more fun when it's on the floor, you know. <laughs> on the table, you're know, oh, yeah. around. So it's a lot more fun when it's on the ground and played with. So we're ready, ready for the next one. Oh, we're ready for yeah, the next one. one. Okay. 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 Let's go on. Okay. This was another fun interchange. From the set. same place. Same era, same place. No, same oh. place you bought it. Oh, yes, exactly, exactly. Same oh, uh, my God. store. So, yes. So what is it? It is Barbie's Fashion Shop. La, the Fashion Shop. <laughs> of course, it came out at the same time the Fashion Queen did. And if we open this up, we're going to show you why that is. Yeah. So it's really cool. They got the front graphic over here <gasps> for the for the doll. And they have this plastic um, latch that's holding it. It's like a little belt. Yeah. Oh, there you go. Like, oh, my God. They there. stapled the so, crap out of it on this side. Oh, yeah. So you let that, <laughs> let that down. Same way. That's the front. But then it unfolds. And it unfolds. So let's arrange it and show everybody. But this yeah. one is actually a lot more um, kind of better to play with, I feel, because of the fact that it's not too many pieces. So how do you want to arrange it? Any way you want. Um, this is one something, once again, your you imagination. You can uh, play around with it. Very it's long over. gold carpet, and it looks like flooring uh, for Barbie. So it's basically like a, a, a storage. Let's tilt it so they can see it. You can't really see it. So it's like basically a fashion shop where Barbie's, hold on, Barbie's shop, you're pushing me, Barbie's shopping, and so a runway for her to basically try on clothes at the boutique, kind of, and then also hang out with her friends while she's doing it. Or even Ken, you never know if you want to have Ken come try on some tuxedos or pants or shorts or whatever. But like the other structures, it has furniture galore. Um, and it's uh, some of this stuff. Uh, you have to assemble, of course, yourself. Yeah, so, let me put these so the kids, once again, yeah. crafting it, putting things together, interacting. Barbie, I mean, Mattel, having these people and these kids use their minds. I love it. Then right here, you have a little, um, like, a jewelry display, little ca- case right here, which is really cool. Uh-oh, oh, well, these legs are not cooperating today, so I'll leave it alone. So these little uh, wooden legs that are messing with George right now, um, they just have these little holes at the bottom, and unfortunately, you know, wear and tear this, uh, it just loosens them up, and it's 
really easy for them to kind of just fall right out. Ah, like we just didn't can. And this is the fun runaway that I was talking about where you can put Barbie right here and she'll be modeling her clothes for her friends at the boutique. It's just very fun, very, um, oh, oh, wow, okay, there we go. And then it has a little table, so it goes around the fashion show. Mm -hmm. and this goes like right here. And then you got counter. doors that keep out of here. Hello. There we go, right here, right here, right here, right here. There we go, we've got it. And then they also came with a little mannequin, which is for the display window. Um, fortunately for me, I have two of them. Um, so that's kind of neat. And it comes with this little long, what is that, full length mirror for Barbie. So she can uh, check out her fashions that she's trying on before she takes them home, but we all know she's gonna buy them all. And here's uh, another fun little thing uh, that comes with it is this little display uh, that hangs right in front of the mirror, or sorry, the window, display window. It's a shop. It's a shop as well as a, as a, um, like a boudoir sort of situation for Barbie. So there you go real quick, just so you can see what it looks like. It has a little window, you put your little mannequin, a fashion show today. Yeah, and that one's fun to face out like that, because you can definitely play a lot with that and do a lot of fun scenarios where Barbie's hanging out. This is another piece in the middle right here that creates oh, yeah. more of a little wall right here. Kind of keeps it all together. Mm -hmm. Very awesome, very cool. I love this one. To me, this is my favorite of the three. I like this one because it's more about fashion. It's more, it has the, the cutouts. It has all these, this runway situation. It's just, but to me, it's more, more my alley. I really do like this one. But same, they use this lithograph cardboard and they still have this material. Oh yeah, then the hangers that came with it. You use for this one. This, this set came with the red hangers. There you go, to hang Barbie's clothes. And those what little does it? Yeah, it's more. Uh, there you go. Here we go. Yeah. Hang all her costumes and her outfits in her fashion shop. Love it, love it. And then it came with little fashion, uh, little invite cards to hand out to your friends. Fun, and yeah. say, hey, come to my shop. And they also gave you these little cards uh, as well where you can write the name of the fashion. Uh, thank goodness these were not used. <laughs> but little girls would you know, have the opportunity to write the fashions that they had purchased and just put them outside as a little card that says, hey, guess what's coming up? Kind of neat uh, little interactive uh, thing to have for the girls to play with. And it also came with these two little fashion magazines uh, just to kind of lay on I love these cards. The these are my favorite. These are so cool. Oh, let's show the wig part because you did say it was part of uh, the era of the fashion queen. So this is a neat piece, which is a corner that brings it all together, but it just shows on the outside. Um, and what it is for it, you could put a wig. Barbie wig, because the fashion queen, she was bald because she was supposed to wear wigs. Well, yeah. I don't know, maybe if you like a bald look, but she's intended to wear wigs that's like that one. Like should become a little bit better. There you go. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, that was kind of a neat little, uh, <laughs> little kind of accessory wig. I thought it was, wow, look at that. So this is really hard to find. I like this always one. get lost. Um, but I'm so happy this set came with it. You know, that thrift store, I mean, I just, like I said, took off. Once they, I grabbed it in my arms, it was mine. They're like, it's mine. Yes. So this was a really neat... Um, oh, here, let's just show you one of the little uh, mids real quick uh, on her little runway. Uh, this how one? you would open her, sure, just put her on top of her little... With her prom dress. Her prom dress, showing it off for the mothers to buy. Uh, this is what I want, this is what I'm gonna go into prom with. But that's how, you know, you just utilize the stage like that and play with it and have your dolls uh, have a good time with you and all your imagination. God, that was a lot. What did you think, That's George? A lot. That's a lot. It's a fun though, but it's it's when you look at them collectively, back to back, it is quite a bit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and, and and I don't want to say heavy, but it has a little bit of a of a of a give to it. So it's really a wonder how some of these structures yes, held it yeah. together. And um, uh, one tip uh, I want to share with everyone is tape is not the friend of this product. Um, the thrift store decided, you know, there were some rips in it and. They decided to just put big masking tapes over it. Unfortunately, when you slowly try to pull that off, it pulls off some of the print yeah. of the structure, the name, you know, things like that. So if you're out there, please be nice to these structures and uh, don't tape to, anything. I'm trying to tape them up too much. I mean, I understand that, you know, but sometimes that's the coolness and the uniqueness about vintage toys and stuff is just the the life that they went through and they still, you know, keep yeah. themselves. Yeah, for sure, yeah, because that's what a lot of collecting is. It's like antique, it's more, it's a little bit and that's what makes it unique. So um, what do you think, George? That wraps up this video. Yes, thank you guys.
guys for joining yeah. this episode of Vintage Doll Hunters. So remember, if you have any vintage dolls up in your attic, down in your basement, or up in your closet, be sure to contact us because we'd love to be able to feature and work with you on our next potential video. Thank you again for joining us. You can find us on our uh, Vintage Doll Hunters Instagram or Facebook page and reach out to us and keep checking out our videos. We got plenty Please, more, lots plenty, of stuff. plenty more. Talk a lot. You guys will enjoy it. We promise. Thank you for joining us today. I hope you enjoyed these Barbie structures as much as we did. Yes. We really do. They're really fun. Yes. We home display throughout our house and in the bigger areas where we're allowed to. So thank you so but much, guys. The room is left, right? Oh, yeah. And like they say, it's Mattel. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Have a nice one. We'll see you next time. See you next time. Bye, Bye. guys. So fun. So fun. Let's play. <laughs>